<laughs> All right, so one question we like to ask is, yes. candidates always promise to be creating jobs. Everybody yeah. wants candidates to create jobs, but what is your unique take? What do you see as a way that you can create jobs that's different than other candidates? Well, you know that government doesn't create jobs. It's, yeah. it's small businesses who create jobs. So in order to do so, we need to step back. We need to lower taxes, make sure that the debt and the deficit is not too big. We need to put money back in the businesses. And I have one unique way. I'm the only one who wants to say, like, if many many provinces are paying high electricity bills, yep. this is killing our small businesses and uh, making them less competitive. That's why I'm bringing a package, of course, of, uh, of uh, energy like oil. But we need to go in clean energy, such as nuclear, and with this package, we'll have the lower energy costs in, uh, I would say, in North America, yeah. and we'll be more competitive. You're sparring a little bit with Maxime Bernier over supply management. Um, he's against it. You're really, I do. you're honestly for it. What, I do, I am pitch? honestly for it. If there's farmers in Manitoba who want uh, to promote agriculture, they can come with Stephen Blaney, because my mom was born on a farm, my father was born on a farm, and actually, you know what? This is the best way to provide quality product to consumers. Consumers are benefiting from the system, from the great Canadian model. And we don't want Americans to tell us and to, to come and manage our agriculture. We want to do it by ourselves, and we're doing it in a great way. Would you also then support bringing back the Canadian wheat board? Oh, we listen to farmers. My colleagues from the West are telling me what people from the West want. I can tell you what farmers want, what dairy farmers want. I'm proud I stood up with my conservative colleagues and we are listening to farmers. When I listen to farmers in my neck of the wood, when I listen to farmers everywhere, they tell me, Stephen, we have a great, a great model. And actually, I must tell you, instead of fighting each other, we have to go at the liberals and make sure that they are keeping our border, uh, preventing the American from circumventing products at our border, which is having an impact and creating distress actually amongst our farmers. So we need to stand up for farmers, and I'm standing up for farmers. Yeah. Any last thing you'd like to add? It's great to be in Manitoba, and I thank you for having this little interview. And vote on May 27. Get a membership card, get on board the Conservative. We have great candidates, and I would say this race for me is not just about the economy, it's about being proud Canadian. Thank you. Thank you, Stephen Blaney. Mr. Cooper,